Marriage is the primary picture that our Almighty God chose out of literally every other choice that He could to illustrate for us His relationship with us and us with Him. He chose marriage. Today, right now, you're beginning this new story together. Jordan, as I look at you, I can't help but smile. I have so much praise for the Lord getting us to this exact moment. He has been at work from the very beginning. I know this because on February 24th, 2021, I wrote a prayer in my Bible. I pray that Jordan and I live for you so that we can spread your abundant love. I know that with you as our foundation, we will never be broken. I praise you for giving me the one Lord. We always knew Maddie was a good kid. She just had that charming personality and never got into any real trouble. But it was in high school that we really became proud of her. That's when faith really became important to her and we started to see not only her heart for others, but we started to see her tremendous heart for Jesus. As she reached college age, we really saw a shift in her intentionality, seeking to find the man that God had in store for her. That's when Jordan slid into her DMs, as the kids say. One other thing that stands out during uh, Jordan's junior year in high school, he went to Young Life Camp. And that Sunday, he had renewed his faith in God. It was just all life changing. Then I knew that it changed his life and it has to this day. Then in college, he met this beautiful girl named Maddie. I couldn't help but think of all the different versions of Maddie over our friendship that I would want to tell so much to. I think a lot about what I would tell the version of Maddie that I met freshman year. How I knew she was the type of person I would want to be friends with from the moment I met her after midday. Even though I was so much taller than her, I found myself looking up to her constantly. Her ability to light up the room, as you guys have probably seen today, is truly something special and something that I look forward to every single time I see her. I'm gonna carry you. Wow. Dear Maddie, the Lord has blessed us immensely. My prayer is that today will be a springboard for our future. Through the peaks and the valleys, we will always find our way. I want to tell the version of Maddie that just started dating Jordan, that would come home from their first couple of dates and tell me and Emma, we were wrong, he didn't kiss me yet. Or, he still hasn't told me that he loves me. I'm just about to say it myself. That Jordan will be the most patient man that we've seen walk through the doors of 501 yet. He will set a strong foundation, and he will not waver for a second. He's definitely the man that we've been praying for for you. We're here today on this gorgeous day to celebrate these two, Jordan and Maddie, as they join their lives together in marriage. Marriage is holy. It's established by God himself, thought up by him himself. It is and will be used by him to show us more of him, to make us more like him, and to glorify him.
if I had to choose one word to describe the way I feel with you, it would be peace. I truly believe this is because you not only carry the fruits of the Spirit with you, but you live them out in your daily walk. I see this in the way you extend grace towards others, hold accountability and discipline to a high value, and put others first. As we move forward from this day, I can't wait to see the world with you. No matter what stage of life we're in, I promise to always make time for you and create memorable experiences for us. We have been created to enjoy this world, and I can't wait to explore it. Here's the beginning of the rest of our lives. Love your husband, Jordan Michael Adele. You've shown your love and affection by joining hands and have made promises of love and devotion each to the other. And you've sealed those promises with rings and um, beautiful show of God's love by washing each other's feet. I therefore pronounce that you are husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. Today, I want to say to you that I couldn't be prouder. As you start your life together, know that the people in this room are here for you. Lean on those you love during tough times. Seek guidance in God's word and in those that you trust. And know that no good news is ever too small or too big to celebrate. To the Mr. and Mrs. Idell, may this be the first celebration of many. They were immediately excited about the love for Jesus that they saw in each other and that they saw in each other someone that they could pursue God with. As we know, the rest of the story is history, and here we are celebrating this incredible day. Jordan, we've watched your and Maddie's relationship grow and the bond that you all have. We're honored to have Maddie as a daughter. But Jordan, I want to tell you this. Once you take that patience that you showed me in that batting cage, you can show that to Maddie and love her and be patient with her. And tonight, I toast you all for a beautiful life together. Here we go.